Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we are in episode three of the home makeovers. If you're new here, my name is Imani. I do things all home decor, home inspiration, and home decorating. And if you're returning, then hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to do the bathroom makeover. I'm super excited for this video. So if you guys would like to see this beautiful makeover, make sure you guys stay tuned. Let's get into it, guys. <music> Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I hope you all are doing amazing today. So guys, we are going to start the bathroom makeover today. What I want to do is I want to go to Lowe's and I want to um, look for some shelves to hang in the bathroom and then also look for another mirror. So I think we're going to go to a couple stores today. So um, if you guys want to see that video, make sure you stay tuned. Um, if you are new here, my name is Imani. I do things all home makeovers and inspiring to have the place that I want to live in. And I like to show um, my family that they can achieve anything and um, yeah, and just be inspired. So um, welcome to the channel if you are new and if you're a returning family, then hey y'all, welcome back. So guys, without further ado, we're going to go ahead and head to the car. Let's go. So guys, this is what we're wearing today. Just like some little biker shorts with some little black sneakers and my red Ohio State sweater. So just want to show you guys what I was wearing. So we want to go ahead and head out. These are the shells right here guys so this is the problem that I feel like I kind of figured I was gonna run into this issue um, but I was just being optimistic however the issue is is that the shells for the walls do not need to be this big obviously right um, they have the brackets down here but the shells that we need specifically um, are going to be very smaller than that Hold on, I think I, hold on y'all. I think I just found them. I think I just found them. Let me calm down, hold on first. Honey, y'all know I get excited, honey, when I'm about to create. Now, um, let me show y'all what I just came across though. These. So look what I just found, oh my God. Now what y'all think about these though? Y'all, I think these about to be the W. I ain't even gonna lie, now y'all imagine y'all, these the same ones that I used in my laundry room in my apartment. These are definitely the ones that I want. Um, now, I did want the black ones, but I don't see, I don't see the black ones. Um, but I feel like if I wanted to like, if I was really pressed for them to be black, I would just like spray paint them. But so far guys, I think I'm gonna go ahead and um, get these ones right here um, from Lowe's. I feel like the shelf is long enough. Um, these are the shelves right here. This is about how long they are. And these are $5. And this is the width and stuff right here. And they're white. Like I said, if I want to paint them black, I could. But um, those are $5. I think these are cute. However, like these are cute, but I don't see any other ones. I don't see any other ones. Um, but this this is the shelves that I got right here, which is 458. These are cute, but maybe I should look for some other ones. Hold on. All these are the bigger ones, which I don't need. I just need some smaller ones. So let me let's see what we can find okay so we got some shelves which was good so right now what i want to do is i want to find um some brackets but like some little small ones you know what i mean like like i don't let me see like they got these right here but they're but they're white and they're huge. Oh my God. Wait. <laughs> so I found these right here. 
versus this one right so so i'm not really sure which which side it goes on um but this is the shelf which to me is like a perfect size this is the shelf and i'm like do it go like this or do it, you know what I'm saying? Like, this is what I'm thinking. I feel like. We're today at I feel like it can go like this. Like, right? I feel, this is gonna be so cute. I feel like it can go like this. Okay, y'all, so I'm gonna get four of these. I think I'm gonna just get two shelves. I don't think I'm gonna have three shelves. I think two is enough. Um. These are, these are actually a dollar 78 for these i'm sure i got screws at the house so let's go ahead and go into the mirror aisle real quick can't wait to do the porch y'all oh my gosh that's so pretty so right now we are in the mirror aisle now i did do my measurements and i put them in my phone this is cute I heard somebody say that I should get a circle mirror, but honestly, the circle mirror is more like a boho vibe, so I don't think I'm gonna get a circle one. If anything, I'll get one like this. So the measurements on this one is a 20 by 30, and my measurements at home is 30 inches by 30, 30 inch width, 36 inches height. That's how big it can be or it can be right right up under that measurement so um not sure if i'll get a mirror from here but right now this is a good size but honestly i think i want to probably look for my mirror um at like another store okay y'all so i found this black mirror right here it is a 22 by 28 so I believe it's 28 inches long and 22 inches wide so hmm let me think so the measurements at the house were 36 inches long and then a mirror that I have up there right now is um, I think it's 18 by 24 it has the black trim that I like that's very chic that's really cute and hold on, this is a different one. So this one is a different kind of style, which is, hmm, that's cute. So they got this style, and then they got, th but this looks smaller to me, right? Maybe, hmm, but so far, I see this black mirror right here, and it got the trim on it, and, yeah so and it's only thirty dollars which is not bad and then they got these right here and then hold on let me see yeah they got these and these are all in gold i think yeah these are the 22 by 28s as well right here but i can either get this one right here which it has like this little trim detail on it and then this one is just like a solid one. Comment below, let me know what you guys think. But I'm really considering um, doing the black trim ones. So, yeah, and then I got the silver ones, but I wouldn't even do silver, I would do black. So, I'm thinking, let me see. So this is how big, this is how big it would be. Okay, y'all, so we back outside now. I did get the mirror I was telling you guys about. I couldn't really record in there because of copyright, but I did get the mirror that I told you guys about. I'm just gonna show you guys real quick. And we're about to go ahead and get in the truck, but I wanna show you guys. So, this is the mirror that I ended up getting right here. I like that it had a frame on it. Uh, again, I did see the frameless one at lows but i did not like that one so this is the one that we have for the house which i think is really cute and i just love the elegant look of it in the frame so this is what we got and then the measurements are 22 by 28 so 
I haven't really been able to record in here um, because of the music. The music in these stores is insane. Um, but so far, I have not found the black mat that I wanted. I just found the little gray one, but I'm gonna just get this one for now. And then I also had got me a rod that was on sale, a tension rod, and then this to go inside of the bathroom. Y'all look at this. Like, are you serious? Like they would have this after I bought that little one. This one is 119. I'm about to tell you what I'm about to do. I'm about to go home and get that other one. Put this on hold. Bring the other one back because the tag is still on it. And y'all, it got storage. I paid 60 for this one. And it's like suede. I'm about to bring that back because it's still got the tag on it. And come back and get this. Put this on hold and then come back and get this, y'all. I promise you. I'm about to get this. Like. So yeah. Um. Alright, I'm out. Okay, so right now we just got finished um, putting some holes right here. I think this is where the first one is going to go. And then I'll have the second one about right here. So, yeah. So, that's what we're doing right now. So, just going on. And also, y'all, I didn't know. Like, I know I wanted to. Yeah, I'll figure it out. Cause I really wanted the shelves to be black, but I feel like if I just put like black stuff on there, then it should be fine. So yeah. This is how the first shelf is looking right now. Yeah, so that's how the first one is looking right now. I'm liking the result. Hey y'all, welcome back to another home makeover vlog. So in today's video, we are actually um, still looking for some stuff for the bathroom. We're gonna go in Ross real quick. I'm in a car right now, but we're gonna go to Ross real quick and see if they got like some black mats. Cause that's really what I'm looking for. And I'm gonna also show y'all how the um, shelves end up turning out. I like them y'all, they look so nice. And yeah, so that's what we're about to do right now. I'm about to go in Ross real quick and then see what they got and then probably head to the house let's go guys okay y'all so i found this one right here it's cute you can see the shape in it furry so that's what i found so far i think i might get it let me know what you guys think it's cute so i think i'm just gonna get this rug right here i feel like this is the closest thing to what i'm gonna find what i'm looking for um they got other stuff but they don't have the black. Like, I feel like this would have been cute in the black. But they don't have it. And then they got this right here. Yeah, they don't. Yeah, so that's the closest thing I'm going to get. And if I don't get it, I know that. I'm going to regret it if I don't get it. So, we're about to go ahead and get this. All I really came here for is a mat. So, this is just like a quick little trip. Um, I really just needed a mat real quick. And that's all I need in here. So, we're about to go ahead and head out. So we are now back at the house and I just want to show you guys how the um, shelves and stuff are looking and stuff like that. But 
this stuff right here uh like i said this is the rug that i got today and then that's the mirror that i have for the bathroom and then that's the rod and stuff from yesterday that i had got but i want to show y'all um how the bathroom looks right now this is how the bathroom is looking okay like i said we haven't did, really did anything to it but i wanted to show you guys how the shelves look guys look at the shelves like aren't these so cute comment below let me know what you guys think i just put that up there just because y'all know i can't wait but um yeah but um this is how the shelves are looking and i am loving okay what i'm trying to do is i want to hang up this little bath tile and this bath tile that i actually want to use right here and i think i want to put it right like right here not right there i think it's where i want it to be so yeah but like right here i think is where i want it so yeah I think it looks really cute. Um, it's actually the one that I have from the apartment. I just end up just taking it off the wall and bringing it over here, so. Hey guys, welcome back. It is officially a new day. So right now guys, we're gonna go ahead and decorate the bathroom now since we got everything hung up. I also hung up the mirror too as well. And I'll show you guys how to look here in a minute. If you are new here, my name is Imani. I do things all home decor, home inspiration, and home decorating. If you're returning, then hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I appreciate you guys tuning in to another video. So guys, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the decorating. <laughs> So guys, right here what I have is a curtain, two curtains from Home Goods, and they're 96 inches and I'm just gonna hang them all the way up to the ceiling right here. And this is actually gonna make your bathroom look bigger and just more grand. So that's what I'm doing right here. And then I'll show you guys exactly how it turned out right here in the next clip. These right here are like curtain ties and they're magnetic and they're super cute. this little tray at the Goodwill y'all for 99 cents and it got like these little rhinestones around it it is super nice I'm gonna go ahead and put this on the shelf next to the flowers
So y'all, this is my first time like putting like real books inside the bathroom, and I actually like the idea. Like, it definitely elevated the space, and it was different too as well. end up getting from the Dollar Tree and then I end up getting the rhinestones from Michaels so if you guys are not able to find the kind that you want you can always make your own it was super affordable and it actually looks pretty nice too as well putting up I actually printed those off of Google and then I end up getting the frames from the Goodwill a few months back and I spray painted them black um it is very affordable to print out any type of prints that you would like off Google and it's free as long as you have the internet and that's what I did and then I'm just going to go ahead and hang these up on the wall I might get some new frames in the future and might not I'm not sure but so far I'm liking how it's looking let me know what you guys think below okay guys so i end up painting the bathroom and i end up doing like the ceilings and then the lights right there and 
I just kind of paint it around. So I'm done painting the bathroom and we're going to do the towel and stuff like that and the tub and all that. So it's going to come together really nice. So yeah. Okay guys, here we are. So, what do you guys think about the bathroom? So, I am gonna tell you guys where I got like everything from and stuff like that as I do in all my videos. So, let's go ahead and start with the mirror. So, as you guys seen earlier in the video, I end up getting the mirror from, <laughs> can't believe I forgot already, at home and it was $29.99. Um, and it is a, I believe, 28 by 22. And what I did was, instead of having it long ways, I just went ahead and just put it um, sideways. And I think it actually looks more elegant sideways. Let me know what you guys think. I think it looks really cute. And um, I end up going with the one that had, like, the little detail on the side. Um, yeah. And like I said, this is why I had wanted the black frame. I didn't want a frameless mirror because I knew a frameless was just going to be like way too plain. And y'all, the black just looks so good with the space. Like it just ties in so well and it just looks so good. Y'all, it looks so good. 
I'll be so pleased after I decorate because I know when I decorate my space, it's exactly the way that I pictured it and it's exactly the way that I want it. So I'm super excited about the space. Okay guys, so this flower right here, we got these from Burlington. I've had these for a while. You guys have seen these before. And I think they were $8.99 and it's just like a little like bouquet, which is really cute. And I just put it right here. And I had never had the 30 inch vanity and because I got the 30 inch vanity I'm able to actually put decor on it now because before in my apartment I wasn't able to so I love the fact that I can put it like a flower right there and I can still like put like some stuff over here these right here and actually I've been had these these are not new they just look new <laughs> um, I got these from Ross this was $4.99 and then this one was $5.99 and I just thought these were super super nice with the crush glass so yeah I like the chrome finish too okay so that's where everything on the sink came from this faucet looks so good y'all oh my goodness that faucet looks so good oh my goodness um okay so the um, light fixture came from Lowe's. Um, you guys seen when I installed this when we did renovations. And I'm actually glad that I went with that one because it's the look that I needed for my space. So I'm actually glad that I went for that. I wish they had the five, like they only had the four. But it actually looks really good with the space. So it works fine. Um, this is a vanity altogether. It is very, very nice. It is all white. And it looks pretty good. I'm glad I'm with the all white because at first I was trying to, as y'all know, spray paint the other one black and all that. And I'm just like, mm -mm. <laughs> just get a new one and just be done with it. So I got a new one. And yeah, I haven't even did anything up under here yet. It's pretty empty still. So um, yeah, I do want to like organize up under here and probably make a video on it. So let me know if you guys would want a video on organizing down here, but still making it look like aesthetically, you know, pleasing and stuff. So okay so right here we end up installing the ring that i end up getting from i believe it was lowe's and these rings are only like um these uh are only about like eleven dollars well that's how much it was when i had bought mine um and this is the one from the apartment i just took it off and then brought it here to my house and then i just got like a black tile right here with a white washcloth and then i end up putting a little ring right here which this is just like a nappy ring and then I just put like some little diamond studs around it for Michaels okay so this area right here which I'm so proud of it is so gorgeous like I love this like oh my goodness it looks so good y'all like so good now I ain't gonna lie <laughs> I did some pretty nice bathrooms but y'all by far I feel like this is the best one I did in my home like now don't get me wrong i think my ones in my um apartments was nice too but this one this one is just it's just giving such a very elegant and i think by the walls being white now too makes a huge difference um because my walls was not white in my apartment so i think it makes a huge difference and that's why everything just looks so clean now um remember i was saying that i was um wanting to paint the shelves black I honestly think by the shelves being white just makes it look even more clean and elegant in here. So I'm glad that I did not do the black shelves. I'm glad that I kept them white and then just put black decor on there. So up here, I just have two candle holders with two candlesticks. And then right here, I just have my um, candle holder that I ended up getting from Ross, which was like $6. And then my candle that I got from Burlington, which was like $8. And then this is the Elements of Style book that I ended up getting from one of my subscribers for a housewoman gift. I thought this would pop really good up here and it really just, it just, it was the right touch for this area, like literally. Um, but they do sell these on Amazon if you guys want that. So, um, yeah. And then down here we have the flower, which was... I think it was $8.99 and it came from Burlington. I love these little um fake flowers they're so cute and then guys this little cute tray right here i literally just found this tray at the goodwill for a dollar and i actually ended up grabbing two of them so i got two of those and i decided to put one in here 
and then I just put three rolls of tissue right here it looks really nice so I'm glad I did that and then right here I just have a rolled up face tile um, that I just end up putting a black ribbon on and it just has like a little detail where it's like it has like lines in it so I thought that was really pretty and then down here where we get to the toilet this is actually the skinniest oh that chrome on there shining this is actually the um skinniest toilet i've ever had before <laughs> which is not a bad thing but to me i kind of like the skinniness because it just looks more like elegant everything is elegant <laughs> but um so right here um we have the mirror that i end up getting from the goodwill for a dollar which is super cute let me get you guys a close-up for the details then it just has like diamonds in it right there and it's just like a little mini mirror and then we have um my little coasters right here and then i just end up putting this at the bottom just to kind of create some height and then this vase right here actually came from ross and i think this vase was only like believe it or not like nine dollars so gorgeous i would never forget when i got this vase i was like <laughs> If don't nobody get that vase, I was gonna grab it. I went back one day and then I left it and then I came back and it was still there. Baby, <laughs> I left with it that day, okay? <laughs> this is a very cute vase, very timeless as well. And then I just end up putting a little ribbon over these washcloths right here. And then I just stuck it in here. I thought that was a cute little touch right there. Okay, the tray right here, I actually got from Ross. And I believe this black tray was, I believe it was like $6. Very, very, very gorgeous. Like, I love it. Looks so good. And then over here, I just got a tissue holder, which I didn't even put no tissue on it. Um, and yeah, I got that from Ross and that was like $5 or something like that. Once we turn around, you guys will see these curtains that I end up getting. So the curtains are very, very gorgeous. I got the curtains from Home Goods and I believe they were like $25. Like look how beautiful they are with the studs. They're so cute. Like I can't. And then it's like a sheer like material. So it's like a it's like sheer instead of like cloth. So I thought that was really gonna add a nice piece of glam in here with it being sheer. And then, so the curtains are, I believe, 96 inches. I always get the long curtains to put them all the way up to the ceiling. Y'all know that's my thing. Um, and if you don't know, if you put your curtains all the way up to the ceiling, that'll make any bathroom look more grand. And then it'll just be, um, it'll look bigger. So I love that. Um, so yeah, I thought these were super cute. Uh, white sheer. And then, guys, these are the magnet cuffs. That one of my subscribers end up getting me for a housewarming gift. Thanks again. You guys, look at these. are so... <laughs> these are, like, gorgeous. Like, wow. These are so pretty. And then, y'all, um, I was just daydreaming. <laughs> and then, y'all, they magnet, so you can unhook them. They're kind of hard to unhook right now with one hand, but they are magnet, and um, that's what I love about them, too. So I end up getting two of those. Two came in a pack, and then this is the other one over here. And then I just put them on there because I thought that was super nice. Like, don't it just look so good? I love it. So, yeah, uh, these was like $12. They were, like, very inexpensive and very beautiful as well so I, I like those a lot so thanks again who got me those and then also thanks again um for the book for my other lady who got me the book and then back here you guys know this is the shower and then the shower liner came from amazon and it's actually a um lux shower liner because it's not like a plastic one and it's also washable and then i got like the raw tensioner up here because one didn't come with it so i put the raw tensioner up here behind the little uh, wall thing right here which i got the raw tensioner from maybe big lots but you can get raw tensioners from anywhere guys this um lux liner came from amazon so yeah then over here i have my two picture frames that i've been having since the old apartment i really wanted to get some new ones these are work for now but um one just says so fresh and so clean clean then the other one says lather rinse and repeat and I've just had those since the old apartment. Rug right here, I just got from Ross. 
and the rug was actually ten dollars so i thought that was cute for the space and it just has like this really pretty um pattern in it and it's like very very soft too as well so yeah i got that from ross for a couple dollars so yeah that is how everything is looking so far um i started to put a um a curtain rod up there but it just didn't make sense um it was gonna be too many curtains in here this is enough this needs to stay plain because that's gonna keep it nice and clean in here so i'm not gonna put a curtain up there okay but yeah this is how everything turned out guys and i'm loving the results comment below let me know what you guys think i know it's a lot of black and white but that is definitely my little thing i might do color one day but not right now but let me know what you guys think, guys. I love it so much. Okay, guys. So that sums up today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed the bathroom makeover. Comment below which part was your favorite and which part of the decor did you like. And then just like what would you do different. And do not forget to give this video a thumbs up if you guys enjoyed it. And do not forget to subscribe if you like anything home decor and creating a space that you want to live in. I love you guys and I thank you guys for watching. And I hope you guys all have an amazing day. Bye, guys.